Hi everyone, this is a tutorial on creating a Zoho email ID. So to create a Zoho email ID, you will first need to create an account on Zoho. Once you create an account on Zoho, then create a Zoho email ID. Do not try to create Zoho email ID directly. For example, when you search on, um, when you search on Google like Zoho email, and you directly go to this page and you get an option of creating a personal email ID. Somehow you'll always get an error on this page when you try to directly create a Zoho email ID. So the best way is to create a Zoho account by going on zoho.com, click on sign up, enter your Gmail ID, enter any Gmail ID to create an account on Zoho. So I'm creating, I'm entering my personal email ID put any password, click on I agree, click on sign up for free. This will create your Zoho account. Okay. Not Zoho email ID. Okay. So it's asking me to choose a stronger password. So let me put a little bit stronger password and then click on sign up for free. Now it will create your Zoho account. Look, this has created your Zoho account. Uh, this is Aditya High Counselor 1. Now, you need to create your email ID. Click on this mail. Well, now you will click on access Zoho mail. And here you will get two options. Okay, first create domain based on email account in Zoho. Uh, this will be your domain.com. Uh, but no, you have to choose the second option, zohomail.com. Okay, guys make sure that you choose the second option that's create email account as username at zohomail.com. So you can put any uh, username like I'll put Aditya7900 at zohomail.com. Click on create mailbox. Okay. So now it says your status in Zoho is still unverified. Why it is showing this? Because it is asking you to verify your Gmail ID that you have used to create this Zoho account. So simply go to your Gmail account. Okay. And here you will find Uh, an email from Zoho. Okay, you'll find an email from Zoho saying welcome to Zoho. And you just need to click on this confirm account. When you click on this confirm account, it will say verify your email address. Click on verify. And then access your account. And then again, you remember you need to create the email ID. So you'll go to this mail. Now you have to choose the second option, zohomail.com. And as I mentioned earlier, enter any username, aditya7900 at zohomail.com. Click on create mailbox. Okay, now it is still showing that your status in Zoho is still unconfirmed. So guys, uh, even although I have confirmed uh, the email in my Gmail inbox, it takes, uh, I've noticed that it takes about uh, 30 minutes to one hour for Zoho to recognize that we have already verified our account. And after that, when you'll create, when you'll try creating your Zoho mail ID, it will allow you to create this. Okay. So once you verify your email, uh, your Zoho uh, account in your Gmail, just wait for 30 minutes to one hour and then try creating the Zoho mail ID and it will allow you to create. Okay. After one to two hours of verifying your Zoho mail in your Gmail ID, uh, as I mentioned, it sometimes takes a few hours. Come back to this page again and now create your Zoho email ID. So I'll create something like Aditya8900 at zohomail.com. Make sure guys, the extension is zohomail.com. Do not select the first option, okay? It's the second option. Click on create mailbox. And now it will create my email ID. Perfect. So it has created my Zoho email ID. Hello, Aditya, Hi, Counselor One. So this was my 
uh, Zoho account and this has created my Zoho email ID. Let me show you quickly access Zoho mail. And here, if I go, I can see that I have my Zoho mail ID, Aditya8900 at zohomail.com already created. Now you've created your Zoho email ID and it's time to integrate this email ID in High Counselor email networking tool using LMS. But before you integrate, there is one very important step remaining. That is to make the Zoho email ID as your primary email ID for the Zoho account. So simply go to click on your uh, profile icon, go to my account, scroll down and here you can see the Gmail ID that you utilize to create the Zoho account and the Zoho mail ID that you have just created. You need to make the Zoho mail ID as your primary address. Click on set as primary address, click on make primary. And now your Zoho mail ID is your primary email ID. Guys, this is a very important step before you integrate Zoho mail ID in your email networking tool.